Anusha Chauhan, a proud Fintra man, also an ACC faculty. So March exams are around the corner. So here are a few things that you should be doing and make sure you're doing that for your March exam. So let's start. First thing, make sure you have a plan ready that, okay, this is the date that my exam is. So make sure you have that plan ready that, okay, by this date, I will finish my entire syllabus. And from another date, you fix that, that I will definitely start my revision. And you could keep two days, three days, depending on your preference. That this many days is only for revision. And apart from that, you are dedicating every day some time for solving questions. And not only just solving questions, but making sure that you're looking at that clock. That yes, you're solving questions by following the time. So that when you actually give the exam, you don't feel that time pressure, right? Another important thing is that you need to make sure that you have decided that, okay, I will give my mock exam on this day. And of course, if you're studying with Fintram Global, we will have a mock exams. Make sure you attempt that and the faculty will also give their performance evaluation to you. Another important thing is, of course, uh, you know, in case you are self-studying, you can definitely visit our website when we have revision boot camp. Yes. You can just see the revision sessions and also, you know, do the question marathon wherein we are solving so many questions. So this is going to be very helpful just for the exams. Then another important thing is that after you've completed your syllabus, you've done your revision, mock exams, you are keeping some time just to practice on, let's say, the computer because these are computer-based exams. So when you practice questions every day, let's say you take 30 minutes, you know, we usually like to solve it by on a pen and paper. That's fine. You could do that. But also make sure at least once a week you are using your you know, computer also to practice those questions, whether it's typing and whether it's solving a question in Excel. So make sure you do that so that when you actually give the exam, you are not, you know, don't feel like that. Okay, I don't know how to use all these functions in case this is your first exam, of course. Otherwise, you would already have the practice, but I would still suggest make sure you practice. So March exams are around the corner. Don't worry, stay motivated and make sure you complete entire syllabus area, keep time for revision and definitely give a mock exams and do keep a check on your health. You know, during exams, it is important that we stay healthy, stay calm so that we are able to give our best performance out there, right? So make sure you sleep on time and you study for as many hours you have dedicated you know it will depend on your other commitments as well but make sure every day you study even if it's for 20 minutes you are revising something or you're watching a video make sure you do that all the very best and happy learning this is disha johan signing off